Saw Brad, that. tell me a little bit. Go started in on this, and I don't know where he was headed. Um, but you fought Elias Theodoro mm -hmm. over the summer. Uh, you guys went in there, competed, you won, and then you were telling us that things were pretty respectful. What has happened lately that goes pointed out? I, I just didn't have enough time to see it, or nor did or am I privy to what he's nah, talking about. Just you guys I guess button I mean, heads on social media. Or nah, something? nah, nah, not at all, not at all. Like he hasn't been like talking shit or anything, but just after the fact. So like after we fought, you know, like even before we fought, he was super cool. I could tell right away that you know he was one of those guys that just would try to get into like this fucking social media banter just to try and you know like hype a fight or whatever trying to everybody's trying to do the conor mcgregor thing now um but when i met him i was like oh dude is super cool super respectful after the fight you know he just gave me my props congrats great fight you know it was a tough fight whatever so uh yeah and then uh i guess after that fans of his that thought that he won the fight or whatever started going about it and then he kind of jumped on that wave too and w was saying stuff and i just was like you know like, I kind of put an end to it. I just said this. I was like, look, three judges that night saw it, you know, differently. And uh, it is what it is. The, the fight happened. The fight is in the past. And I wish the best to Elias moving forward. I already got my fight scheduled next. I'm, I'm not worried about it. I'm moving onward and upward. So that was that. All right. Uh, Talos Latus is the onward and upward. Mm -hmm. Upward, excuse me. He's coming off a win over Sam Alvey himself. He's been ranked in the top ten before. Uh, he's even competed for a world title at at middleweight versus Anderson Silva in the past. Yep. Got cut by the UFC, and now he's kind of had a little bit of a, of a resurgence. resurgence. But tell me about that uh, matchup. Is that something you went for, or is that just something that was thrown on your lap? Uh, no, it, it had been talked about right after Elias' fight. You know, It's a fight that I was supposed to have last year, but uh, due to injury, didn't happen. Um, it's a fight that we liked, uh, myself and my coaches, uh, my management, and so it's a fight that, you know, we wanted to make happen. It makes sense, and uh, I like it, so. And then I got lucky, you know, like, they they allow me to fight here again, so thank you to the UFC. Thank you, Mick Maynard, Dana White, Sean Shelby, all those guys.